I did some sea fishing this week and my original plan was to go here and fish off the, the back of the harbour at Dunbar. But the weather was so bad, I ended up heading right across the other side of the country to Weems Bay. I was just looking for a kind of rocky mark on, on Google Maps and uh, I found this place I'd never been before so I didn't really know what to expect. The weather still wasn't great through here when I arrived but it was so much better than the east coast and it's always nice to get out and try new places. I had three rods with me, a heavy rod, a really lightweight rod and a lure rod and I also brought my lobster pot just to, to see what it was about. I was really hoping to catch a, a wrasse or something on the heavy rod but while I was waiting on bites I was going to spin and drop shot just to, to keep myself busy. I had a few different baits with me. I had mackerel, lugworm and prawn. On the main rod I had just a really simple one up one down and I had worm on the bottom and prawn on the top to start off. I had been pike fishing twice in the last couple of weeks and blank. So I was hoping I was going to at least catch one fish today. I ended up catching quite a few. Not what I had in mind, but can't complain when you're catching fish. And the two surprise catches were, were really nice to see as well. So with the baits in the water, I set up my, my lure rod and I started off with a, a metal. Oh, getting bites. Need to get the spinner in. There we go, first fish, first cast. Little tiny Pollock. First fish of the day, came on a wee bit of prawn. Nice wee Pollock. There he goes. Superb. Baited up, we'll get them out again. Feels like a better one, this. A little bit bigger. Slightly bigger. Nice wee pollock though. Just happy to be catching fish after the last couple of times. Straight away. Oh, just had a wee strike there. Another little pollock. Just about six feet from the edge. Oh, good bites on the other rod. You get this in. There we go. Two 
feels like another small pollock. Well, there's plenty of baby pollock here anyway. Hopefully there's a few big ones. I'm really hoping for a wrasse as well. Another little tiny one. I'll bring the pot up and just see what's in it. Should really leave it till the end, but I'm curious, so I'll just throw it back in again. Absolutely nothing. Did not expect that to be empty. Usually I at least catch something in the trap. Every other time I've used it, it's had at least small crabs in it. I've even caught fish in it before. I think they were, I think they were dabs. So I added another chunk of mackerel and threw it in a different place. After the empty trap, I couldn't believe what I caught next on the rod. Oh, there's a big crab. Look at that. Unbelievable, look at the colour of it. I think I need the forceps for him, I'm not risking my fingers. Thought it was a bit of a weird bite. It was actually hooked in the mouth as well. Hoping that picks up the the purple colour. At least I know what's been stealing all the bait. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a seal with a big flounder in its mouth. I picked this place because it looked so rocky, but after speaking to a local, I learned that it's actually a really sandy bottom out there, and that catching a wrasse was pretty unlikely. So I casted the heavier rod out further on the sand, to the target flies, and I used my little lightweight rod close in to catch the inevitable small bullet. <laughs> Bit better sport on this rod. <clears throat> it's 
swallowed. I didn't half swallow that. I think he's okay though. There he goes. Beautiful wee fish. Little bites on that. I passed it a lot further out this time. But, just another little pollock. Well, at least it's another species. Not quite what I was hoping to catch, but it's interesting to see. You don't see these every day, so... This one was a, a really nice colour as well. Really weird texture as well. It was a, a lot harder than I thought. I mean, it looks quite soft, but they're really, really tough. Maybe another crab on that. A little fish. <laughs> it's always nice to catch fish but I was only getting a little ball like so I called it a day and decided to, to pack up and pull up the pot. I can't believe that's empty. It's the first time it's ever come up empty. I think the fishing would have been better at Dunbar, but I couldn't couldn't face the weather there, so it was just nice to, to get out and do a bit of fishing, even if the fish were small. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you again soon.